Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Card Game Guru here today, and today we're back playing some Jun Sacrifice, Jun Food. Um, Trail of Comes version, not the Bolus of Citadel version. Can you put Bolus of Citadel on this one? I think you can. Alright. Anyways, I haven't really changed anything since the last time we played. Um, pretty stock list. Pretty wild card heavy, unfortunately. But a lot of the good cards you're going to use forever, like Thoughtseize. Your land base is where most of your wild cards are used. Um, but as long as this deck's playable, you're always going to need Woe Strider. For a while, I tried playing it without Woe Strider, and it just never really worked. Um, but with all that being said, before we jump into our first game, remember to smash that thumbs up button if you like this content and want to see more. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you want to see content like this on a daily basis, and let's jump right in. So we have this fun hand that we always have, where we got a goose... But we can't really devil on too effectively. I think we're going to keep, though. All right, well. Yeah, we'll keep. I think we're going to go Fabled Passage 1, then turn 2, Goose Oven. Playing against Mono Red. Okay. So we're more than likely going to lose our Goose. Oh, we drew our third land. Hmm. Do we think we're going to lose our Goose? Is it worth shocking? I don't think so. So I still think we're going to play the Fabled Passage Pass. Um, and we're going to go get a forest. Right. We'll take another one. Down to 18. Put going to discard their hand for Bowmat Carrier. That's unfortunate. Thermo Alchemist. Sure. Crack the Fabled Passage. So we have black, green, red in our hand. Um, we're definitely not getting red. Ooh, do we have any double pips? Not really. Let's grab a swamp. Now we're gonna draw red source, aren't we? Yeah, that's fine. Oh, I actually should have grabbed a forest there. So I could have played this untapped. It's a bit of a misplay. We're gonna take two unnecessary damage. Play the goose. Play the oven. Last turn. This game does tend to be grindy. Um, next turn is going to be very good for us if we can play this Mayhem Devil. So we can like sack of food for the goose and sack the goose to the oven. Okay, Laminap Ruins, that's a good one. Bowmat Courier number two. Also a good one. How many cards I got under this? Two. It's gonna be three now. Not a whole lot we can do, right? Do I want to get Spike Field Hazard? Mm hmm. So I'm gonna be soaking up two damage by blocking with the goose, but I'm just gonna pass. I don't wanna block. I don't wanna get hazard here. Another Thermo Alchemist, sure. So now we're racing two damage a turn, and that's probably not as good for us. Um, play Red Pathway. Do we play Woe Strider first? I think I'm just going to kill both of our Bowmat Carriers here. Um, we're going to sack a food, make a whatever. Kill this Bowmat Courier. And sack the Goose. Kill the Bowmat Courier. Number two. Points down the two cards at hand with two Thermo Alchemists. We're at 14. Can easily still lose. Really need to draw a Cauldron Familiar. Um, looks like they're going to kill our Mayhem Devil here. Get up the stage. Okay. No whammies on killing my Mayhem Devil. He might actually die this turn, right? Little Alchemist, sure. Another light up the stage. Two lands. Give me two lands. Go my courier, Gitu Lava Runner. Yeah, okay. Down to six, seven? 
ramming up ruins. They have like light or skewer skewer. Light skewer number one. Number five. Do we have another skewer in their hand? That would be disgusting. Phone that carrier, okay. Number four. Binding. Binding kills a thermo alchemist, but we still die to the hasted lava runner from uh to light up the stage. Um hmm. I think we play this tapped play the woe strider pass. Down to two. They got a burn spell in their hand. Feels like they do. Lava runner. Okay. Soul scar mage. Sure. Okay. Got attack trigger. Just gonna block like this. Block like this. Wizard lightning. That's really bad. What you wanted from us. Yep, we're dead. Okay. I'll see you guys for the next game. And hopefully we can break our loser streak. Uh, we're back for game two here. This hand's much better than our last. We'll keep. Um, we're going to have to shock in this overgrown tomb, unfortunately. We're going to goose. Hopefully they don't pick our goose. We don't pick our goose opponent. I mean, we could have thought these there as well. The sulfur falls. So they're on... Phoenix. Is it worth shocking in this cauldron familiar? What are we going to play on turn three? Probably nothing. So let's lead on Thoughtseize. Oh, they're on control. So I'm looking at Mizzix Mastery, Torrential Gear Hulk. Um, Mastery is going to be better for them in the late game. They're so far away, though. Let's take the gear hulk. And then I do think I'm okay with shocking in this familiar now. They don't really have any pressure. No real reason to not just play something. Especially against or shock in. They're going to kill our goose. That's fine. That's fine. We didn't need it anyways. I mean, we had a turn for Corval, but... Eh, tomato, tomato, right? Attack for one. Fast turn. Really would like to draw a... Oven? Oven be, would be, be a good one to draw. Hold Tom tapped. Woe Strider. I like Woe Strider, too. Um, from the four out of the five cards we know in our hand, they do not have a way to stop this Woe Strider. Let's play the Woe Strider. The token. Probably going to sack the token at instep to make sure we can cast the Corvold. Now oh, they got commit open now. Probably not now. I didn't think about that. Um, I still think I'll do it right. Sack the goat. Looking for a land untapped. Or a collected company. Either of those are hits for me. Binding is not. Uh, is it a hit? We can blow up one of their lands. No, I don't think so. Another not the greatest draw in the world. Attack the four. Thirteen. Add Giganta to our hand. Pass turn. Do they come they probably need to commit the Woe Strider here. I got a Magma Opus, sure. That's a good one. Some close to Mizzix Mastery, unfortunately. Is 
the blood pathway, sure. Physics mastery of a magma opus. That's fine. Seems a little early. We're putting almost no pressure on them. Can kill our board though. I mean, if that's what they're worried about, that's fine. I guess they get to draw two cards. This might be another Mizzix Mastery, to be honest. Looking for a land here. Yeah, we'll keep it. It's fine. in the stomping ground, play Corvold. Back to food. Mayhem Devil's a good one. Definitely like a Mayhem Devil. <laughs> worst draw from our opponent here would be another magma opus or worst draw for us anyways would be another magma opus I think I don't think we can come back from another one of those unfortunately what you got opponent too pushy too picky too pick too pick I'm gonna call it too pick could be wrong. I'm willing to be wrong on that one. It's not a hill I'm willing to die on. Getting roped. It's okay. It happens. Maybe they disconnected. Our opponent's in a pretty good position here. I mean, card equity is in their favor. Um, they have one more mana than us, right? Yeah, they have six. We have five. Our opponent DC? That would be unfortunate. <laughs> Looks like they DC'd. Now they're out of timeouts, so. We drew a Witch's Familiar, too. Huh. So, Mayhem Devil. Was I supposed to play Mayhem Devil here? I could have played the Giganta. have commit for our Corvold. I actually do think I was probably supposed to play the oven. Why didn't they commit the Corvold? Okay. That's fine. I'll play oven. Even the gate. Don't negate. Move to combat. Four damage to our color bold. It's fine. The one. Oh, it's six. Oh, I messed up. Oh, that was a goof. Rip. I'll just assume our opponent played it correctly. And did it before I entered combat. Fairy is a magic card that I'm not excited to play against. Yikes. Take up the fairy. Yep. Yep. We're not getting Nars headed memoried. Took our four, go to eight. What do we play here? What do we play? We don't just play another Corvel, do we? Probably like Woe Strider. It's a good draw. That's a good one. Um, they have counter spell mana up though. Are we ever going to get the chance to cast it again? The oh, I gotta exit cancel. I gotta exile my cat to do that. It's not something I'm particularly interested in doing. Just play Giganto? Which feels bad. Ooh, I landed. Okay. Pillar Teferi. 
is resolved. Take it. We will definitely take it. On the four. Okay, can we get a memory here? Sure. Now the Glacial Fortress. Played the Glacial Fortress. We still know one out of their five cards. Mayhem Devil. There's no way that one resolves, right? Let's get an overgrown tomb tapped. <laughs> Keeping up on Holy Heat here does nothing. Pretty big losing streak, unfortunately. As always, guys, if you like this content, as I said earlier in the video, remember to smash that thumbs up button. Really appreciate it. Remember to subscribe to the channel to see content like this on a daily basis. And I hope you guys have a great night. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.